the holiday season is right around the corner. So we're talking about managing holiday stress, how to stay positive despite the pandemic, changing the way that we celebrate. So joining me now is Dr. Brian Allman, author of and founder of True Sedge International with some tips on finding your joy. Good morning, doctor. Yes, we are already hitting the holiday season. I'm seeing decorations going up. People are really kind of getting into it early this year. And I think a lot of that is to find joy, is to move forward, right? It is true. I mean, we all have joy inside of us. It's been there all along. We can bring it out in other people. We can find it deep inside of ourselves. So yes, the holiday season of 2020 can be joyful for everybody and we can help ourselves and help other people at the same time. We have some very simple tips that people can use in 10 seconds. Right, and you're starting with make the choice to be positive, right? Right, right. the ultimate power is the power of choice. You know the saying, Allie, is the glass half full or half empty? Mm -hmm. Well, it's both. It's a question of how do you choose to look at it? So you can focus on what's wrong, there's plenty, and you can focus on what's right. It's your choice. It really is. What are you gonna decide to do? You can do both, but you always wanna end up with focusing on what's right about your life, what's right about other people. You wanna to get to the joy with some of these simple tips that we're gonna share. And obviously being joyful, that is the goal, not being negative, not getting into that depression, that bad space. I mean, that's what you're looking for here, right? It is. It, you, we can choose well-being. We can choose exhaustion and burnout. It is a choice. So it really is a question of looking at both and deciding which way do I want to go, like a fork in the road. Which direction am I going to go? and make the decision, make the choice. You will listen to yourself when you make the positive choice. And stress reduction, how can you achieve that? I mean, is it just when you feel that stress coming on, you take a break, you take a deep breath, what do you do? Well, first of all, you have to realize, okay, be aware, I'm stressed right now. Don't try to deny it or pretend it isn't. Just acknowledge it, accept it, allow it. Walk outside for 10 seconds, Mother Nature heals. Take a deep, satisfying, let go breath. You know, you can breathe your way through anything as long as you exhale. And you can really say what you would love to have happen. For example, Ellie, if we want to feel more joy, we can just say joy, joy, joy three times. We'll listen. We can say love, love, love. We'll listen. When we're around other people, when we say to them, I love your smile. I love the way you handle that situation. I love being with you. Whenever we tell somebody we love something about them, it triggers their joy. And interestingly enough, it triggers our own joy at the same time. So it's a two for one deal. All right, and obviously, yeah, it will be different. People won't be celebrating in the same ways. So whatever you gotta do in order to find that positivity and that joy. Dr. Brian I, Allman. I want to tell you, Ellie, there's two yeah. free resources for people. Oh, teachers perfect. are super stressed. And there's a free resource for all teachers called Viber Resource Center. And there's a free resource for everybody to get de-stress, relaxation, joy techniques at truesagelibrary.com. So there's free resources. You are not alone. There's a lot of us that will help you feel joy during the holidays for free because we want everybody to feel as good as they can and focus on what's right about their life. Oh, that's great. Thank you so much, Dr. Brian Allman. We appreciate you giving us a little bit of joy this morning, teaching us to take that deep breath. Appreciate you. Thanks, Allie. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Bye.